Hello, everybody. Ultra Mario here, and welcome back to some more Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Doing off where I left off, and we'll play for a bit wait, more for, um, Petal Meadows. Wow. Such a surprise that I found another uh, star piece after Gabella just hit it that I should hit trees. You know? Okay. Also, I'll just move this. No. Sorry. There we go. It's good now. Wow. Whoa! What was that? I've never seen anything that humongous before. It looked kind of scary, too. It definitely flew into that castle back there, right? Let's get going, in case it comes back. Here we go, again. It's got an indent, as if you could put something in there. Wish I knew what this shape was supposed to be. No. I already did that last time. This rock kind of reminds me of a pipe. Maybe I shouldn't have bought so much mushrooms. I mean, you can find so many just in the field, too. Hold up, my timing's a bit off here. My... Uh, okay, I'll let, I'll let it do this first. Alright. Honestly, normally I do HP first, but... Nah, I'll do HP first. Something is definitely off with the controller. Like a second off. Okay, okay. Give me a second here. Just gotta unplug it. Plug it back in. Give me one second. And now I gotta just, you know, get it to not be frozen. Oops. Okay, one second more. All right, there we go. Okay. Yeah, it just desync sometimes with the thing. So. Oh, a bat! Damn it! If I knew I would get another bat show soon. I would have just. Gotten the badge points. I don't know though. Well, okay, two people. I don't need it right now. Oh, okay. I have enough BP. Ah, the petal meadows. The scenery's super nice, but watch out for all the goombas here. Make sure you're always strong enough. Make sure you've already got enough HP to FP to fight, will ya? Oh, and you can press R to check your stats too. Yeah, let me just. Uh, grab my phone in a second. I'll do that in a second, though. Oh, 
Alright, I gotta ring my phone real quick. So I have it on me. Give me a sec. Yeah, I don't know. Of course, it's always in the couch. Okay. Oops, I am back now, again. Part five. HP. Not a lot, but hey, it's something. Oh, one more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself wondering what to do, just press the other... Bro, I already do that all the time. Sometimes everything looks ordinary. Then you hit something with your hammer and make a discovery. This is Brittle Meadows. The river running through here totally makes the air crisp and refreshing. Wow, this is just like a super paper Mario.
welcome, travelers. Hmm, where are you? Uh, where are you, you ask? Well, this is Pedalburg. Sorry, but it's been a long time since we've had visitors here. Yippity, once that dragon hooktail was spotted flying around this area, well, it didn't help tourists and put it that way. People just stopped visiting. Dragon? Okay, oh, that must have been that huge thing we saw earlier, Mario. So, it's called Hotel, huh? Ooh, scary name. Poof. By the way, Green Boots, have you ever heard of these things called Crystal Stars? We're on this quest for them. It's very important. Crystal Stars, you say? Hmm. Nope, can't say that I have. Sorry about that. You may want to speak with the mayor, though. He's old. Really, really old. As such, he knows all kinds of stuff. Koopas of his age are, um, really smart. Anyway, the mayor lives in that pink house up ahead. Pink house? Sounds totally hideous. But it should be easy to find. Thanks for your help. That's a Pedalburg Koopa. He seems like the spokesperson for this town. How's this guy think he's running for mayor? He must be more ambitious than he looks. Visitors are so rare here. But they're always welcome. Make yourselves at home. This is Pedalburg. It's nice and warm here, and the air is so clean. Such a peaceful hamlet. There's a shop and an inn, so you buy stuff and rest. Oh, and one more thing. The river's pretty, but fall in and nibbles will get ya. That's the Pedalburg innkeeper. She'll take care of you when you're hurting. Don't get all proud and overdo it out there. I mean, everyone has their limits. Hey, and staying at an inn will even refill your star power. Doesn't that rule? This good sir is an inn. Rooms are five points per night. Care to say can I Do come again? Buy and sell items in here. I gotta say, it reminds me of the guy in the rogue port shop. Yep, real similar. Hmm, maybe it's just me. Maybe I should just not worry about it. That's a toad from Pedalburg. He seems I've been never get out of his look on most things. He also seems freaked out by everything around him. Poor little guy. Hey, did you happen to pick up any power blocks on your way here? If not, you'll notice that they've got them for sale right here. <laughs> Lucky for you that you stop by. Unless you enjoy getting clobbered to denim plaid smithereens, that is. Well, I could store something. I'll probably find a lot of mushrooms on my way anyway. I love doing that. 
That's a pedal bear Koopa Troopa. He likes spreading rumors about Coattail's treasure. Unless they're not just rumors. Hmm. Oh, Hooktail, she lives at the top of that old castle beyond this hummock in Metal Petal Meadows. Have you heard the rumors? Some say lots of treasure is hidden in that castle. Scores of people have gone in search of it, but not a one has returned. So, what do you think? You're getting scared, huh? This kid sure is a fanatic. All he talks about is video games. You never saw it? Wonder if he's finished his homework for today. You know, homework's important too. Hey, what's up? I gotta say, I've been playing a lot of GBA games lately. There's this one game that just absolutely rules. It's called Fire Emblem. You ever heard of it? Man, it rocks my socks. That's Bobulber. Doesn't it kind of weird you out to see a talking flower? I mean, where's his head? Is it the flower part or the bull part? <laughs> Top of the morning. Does I, Bobulber? I'm as happy as can be. Why? Simply because I'm surrounded by flowers. Wow, he's depressed. That's General White, the Babam. I guess white bombs are pretty rare. He has a cool mustache, too. He might even give your lip gloss run for its money. Hut, I am General White. I am a Bobom, and I have lost my hopes and dreams. I live in solitude always. I must apologize, but I ask that you leave me alone. He seems kind of important, I don't know, man. Bruh, if you knock the stuffer around, he freaks out. <laughs> Yo, that's so funny. That's such a nice touch. Freaking hit it with a hammer. This guy's apparently a total die-hard peach fan. He even collects peach merchandise. He has posters and merch displayed everywhere. Boy, get a life, you know what I mean? Hey, Mario, don't tell me you have a secret collection of plush peach balls, too. Hey, keep your hands to yourself in here. Basically, everything in this room is a one-of-a-kind collectible. Grosses me out just being near this weirdo. Alright, fine, whatever. His name is Dupree. He's this icky guy who tries to sweet talk everybody. There, there, no more. <laughs> ah, bonjour, mademoiselle. Isn't it a beautiful day? No, 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 no. Not you, monsieur de la moustache. I am speaking to the lovely little cabbage behind you, Mon Petit Chou. Do you hear me? Beautiful. I bet in this dillard and come away with me. Ew, are you kidding? Ew, nice wig, you disco wannabe. Take a hike, Bozo the Chump. Oh, oh, oh. Jesus, blessé. I am wounded. Such beautiful honesty. Such a sharp tongue. I shall retreat for now. If you change your mind, come find me. I told the sleaze. Let's go somewhere else, Mario. Oh, young lady, you could not forget me after all, is that right? Sorry, I want to get the right picture. The butterflies are blocking him. Such running persistence! This is why I told you. Ah, my love, I'm mon amour. I, I don't know how to speak French words, so I'm kind of going with it. When my mind turns to you, I feel the, mo the moths of love flutter in my belly button. That's... The worst line I've ever heard. Mario, let's ditch this looter already. Let's 
just talk to the mayor of Petalbug and see what he knows. He lives in a pink house. This is Petalburg. The warm weather makes the locals laid back and happy. Wow, and talk about unique personalities. Very individual, individual, individualistic, to put it nicely. Or not so nicely. Downright kooky. That's a bubble, a talking flower. I think he lives in Petalburg. I know he's a plant, but he makes more sense than these other quirky Petalburgers. The village is very nice. Clear water, clean air, absolutely delicious. But this foul hooktail, she's made everyone forget their fortunes. How sad. That's a Petalburg Koopa. He always seems to be worried about something. Weird too, because the rest of his town is so laid back, you know? Boy, the mayor's been so forgetful lately. I'm actually worried since the old guy forgets my name from time to time. Um, well, apparently we don't even know your name because Goombella certainly doesn't know it. That's a toad for Petalburg. He just seems like a regular toad to me. Nigeria leads the secret life as president of the Luigi Pan Club. Yo! That might be important later, I don't know, guys. I hear there's a scary kind of monster that lives in your town. Normal attacks are completely useless against it. Oh, and that's not all. Fire attacks are also useless. The very idea freaks me out. What can I do if one attacks me? I wonder if the shop is a way for me to throw money at the problem. That's Koopy Koo, a local pedagogger. She seems to be Koop's girlfriend. Gosh, she's really cute. She has a gorgeous head of, on her shoulders too. Thing is, because she's smart, she kind of mothers Koop's a bit. A little bit. I guess it's a complicated relationship, but then again, what relationship isn't? Just kill her. Why, hello there. My name is Koopy Koo. It's nice to meet you. The Koopa voice. Oh my gosh, that hat, those overalls, and that magnificent mustache. You're Mario, aren't you? I've heard tales of how strong you are. If you're here, that means you're going to challenge that monstrous hooktail. Oh, if only Koop were as brave as you. My boyfriend Koop is just all sorts of wishy-washy. He's not quite timid, but... Well, I guess I just wish he could be more, you know, manly sometimes. Oh, Koops, why did I have to fall for someone like him? Wait, was that out loud? Don't you dare tell him I said I'm pulling for him. Please, I beg of you. I mean, Goombella literally said you're afraid of his girlfriend, so... That's Koops from Metalburg. He's got confidence issues. He's a cringer, you know? But he's definitely got a serious interest in Hooktail. I wonder why. Um, hi there, folks. Did you come to this village to look for the treasure of Hooktail Castle? Well, that Hooktail is one tough cookie. Destroy the picture of his father. So rude. These are the Traveling Sister 3. They seem to go everywhere. They also seem inattentive. Do they even notice each new place they wind up in? Hey, hey, hey! It's us, the Happy Wanderers, the Traveling Sister 3. The village is famous for its clear water, clean air, and one more thing. That big fat hook tail. We can't wait to see her.
Bruh. This tells me other Albia is good. That's Toasty, a toast from Heidelberg. She seems really happy about something. She does keep, she she sure does keep a straight face though. I guess she's a pretty tough cookie. Hey, since you're here, let me ask, how many people do you think Ducktails gobbled? Well, I mean, all time, I mean. Archie really recently lunched on Old Man Skew, two villages over. And Coops, who lives next door, his father went off to Battle Hotel ages ago. He's been a missing person. No, wait, that's not right. A missing Koopa ever since, bro. Koopas aren't people, according to you. Racism. Destroy your whole house. That's a gatekeeper, Bella Heidelberg. He's super dutiful about guarding this game. But I bet he'd totally run, run for cover if real monsters ever did show up here. Get a feeling about him. Koopa's intuition, maybe. We close the gate because the mayor told us to. My job is guarding the gate. senile or he's just working that angle you know hmm? what was that someone there who was it who what do you want from me I know yo thieves interrupt it's a pretzel so Cooper despicable go on do what you will but as you can plainly see there's nothing to steal here oh I guess I have a little money take it you beans my antique shell tomb Leave the photos of me and the missus. Can't do without those memories. Bro, did his wife die? What is the lore here? What? Not these, you say? Well, what's your story then? Oh, wait. You folks looking for crystal stars? Well, why didn't you pipe up before, you idiot? We're just wasting time here. The crystal stars, you say, you're hunting. Er, um, wait. What did I hear about those dang things again? Aha! Uh -huh, got it! Hooktail! Hooktail's got what you're looking for. She's this enormous, ordinary dragon. Inkfolds, I say. You know Hooktail, right? Of course. I may have heard that name. Well, this Hooktail's brutal fly-by snackings of all of us on pins and needles. So, are you reckless fools? I mean, are you gallant heroes off to rough to rough? You got it. Oh, sounds promising. Why, you can rid us of Hooktail. We'll show you with gratitude and rewards. Wait, what's that of here? You don't accept no reward? I didn't say that. What an unselfish man. You're noble indeed. Yup, a good a, a good egg. 
Now, what did you say your name was again? Murphy, hmm? That's a fine name. Yes, a fine name indeed. Well now, Murphy. It's Mario. The name is Mario. I appreciate that, Murphy. They are nice eyebrows. Now, listen up. Yo, Chin, I'm going to Hotel Castle. Find the secret pipe that's located somewhere in Petal Meadows. I know you need the sunstone and the moonstone to use that pipe. The sunstone, the stones are somewhere in Shrunk Fortress. Just past the village. Get them first. Well then, Murphy. Get going and really wallop that hooktail monster. I'm going to Hotel Castle, then play the secret pipe and it's somewhere in Pantalanos. I know you need the sun- oh yeah. Let's head to Trunk Fortress, past Metalburg. I guess we just follow the road here. Some monsters live at Schwank Fortress up ahead, or so we hear. This gate is here to keep them out. If the mayor says it's okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. Um, excuse me. Er, I beg your pardon. Wait a moment, please. Pardon me for yelling like that. I was panicking. Um, I had to begin. M my name's Coops. I heard you were traveling to Hook House Castle. I, uh, I have a favor to ask. Um. Oh, j just forget it. Never mind. You know me. Good. Goodbye. Okay. That was weird. What do you think is going on and got inside that guy's shell? Um, look, I listen, just forget that whole scene I made earlier, okay? It was nothing. I was just fooling around or something. Be prepared for trouble, and trouble will pass you by. That's what I always say. By which I mean, be wise to stock up on items before you go to Swamp Fortress. Note there are beasts there that you can't beat in battle without items. A personal recommendation? Probably power blocks. Yeah, that's always a solid choice. All right, let's go. We're going to the fortress. I guess we just follow this path. This path leads to strong fortress. Is it just me or is this area darker? There are enemies around, so if you feel weak, we're gonna take it easy, okay? That's a Koopa Troopa. They've been around forever. Gotta respect the longevity. Their shells are hard, but flip them over and their defense drops to zero. And you know how to flip them over, right? Yep, jumps and power blocks. So get in there and get stopping.
Mario, look at our audience. That guy's got a rock. There's no way he isn't gonna throw that at you. It'll get hurt if the audience hits you with, a, with anything, not just emotionally. Quick, stop him before he throws that rock. Try pressing X. Bro, Mario just freaking goes in and kills him. Nice. Later, you lousy troublemaker. From now on, press X to reject any audience members who look like they're holding things. Oh, but there might actually be actual fans out there with items or points for you. Try not to chase them away. Oh, Mario. Now try attacking with your hammer. Sometimes your attacks will cause the backdrop to collapse. It can drop on us too, so watch out. All sorts of other things could happen while we're up here. So stay alert and try to come out on top. Damn, I pressed A. Bad at hoarding. Wow. I'll get through this somehow. If there's something you want to investigate, let me help. This is part of Shawn Fortress. We got a couple of pedestals here. That's it. Looks pretty decent, but this place is actually super old. Did you know that? I'd say it was built about a thousand years ago. Yep, what vibrant ruins. Okay. Oh, no, I didn't, I didn't mean to do anything, actually. Yeah, I want to go about this dialogue. This almost looks like some kind of statue. Wonder if... What if you give it a good hack with your hammer? Oh, I need my uh, power hammer. monster with a sharp, craggy face. Uh, this is kind of mean, but ball guys really just don't do it for me. Yeah, this guy is rock solid. Fire doesn't even hurt it. Might be best to attack with, say, a power block. Or, you know, a P hammer, but... Oh, man. Nice. 
Records of Sunstone and Moonstone being, eh? Be, eh? Let's move on for now. The air here is a bit stale, don't you think? Oh yeah, and listen, Mario. Remember, you don't have to attack every enemy you see. You have low HP. You might want to just avoid them. That's exploring one on one, you know? What could Oh shit. Too many of these things. I don't need this right now. Actually, dang. Like, sure. At least I needed these at that time. What I get for being too good. I don't know, I just like hating everything with hammer. That one has a sleepy sheep, so I gotta watch out. or something. I get rid of a fire flower. Whoa, every time I'm freaking did they, they give you too many of these things. that many power blocks, honestly. I, I shouldn't just pick up everything I see. As much as I'd love to. This is part of Strong Fortress. We got a couple pedestals here. That's it. Yo, to archaeologists, this place is a gold mine. I gotta come back sometime. You look like the last one, so we can give these pedestals the same treatment. But if you also smack this one with your hammer, we'll get the same results as before. Well, then I'll leave that up to you. The other one with the hammer. I 
That's a bristle. Totally covered in spikes. They're so prickly. Max attack 3 is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 4. That's imper and they're impervious to fire. Even trying to get close enough to whack it with a hammer is dangerous. Seriously, spikes will totally pop out. So, since you can't jump on it or use your hammer, you'd better use an item. Yeah, fair enough. Wow, oh, it's just like Paper Mario 6 or Star. You're required to use an item, guys. Now I'm just being done. Oh. The entrance to Strong Fortress is close by. Say, Mario, have you heard about recovery blocks before? Your HP and FP are low. Just hit one of them, okay? Wait, can you just hit random grass and get coins? Damn it, now I have to go back and hit every patch of grass ever. I thought it was just bushes. No. Yeah, I'm going crazy. Wait, why can't I hit the other guy? Whoa, what the? Okay. No. I mean, there's more Koopas around here. Oh my god! Okay. What a strange statue. This is Swamp Fortress, this vicious statue. I'm pretty sure it's a swamp bus. Hey, I just remembered something. I read, a, I read about this place in a book. Whenever the villagers were confronted with the monsters, they'd hide in this fortress. I guess there's a little bit of history everywhere you look, huh, Mario?
<laughs> You're the first contestant I've seen in a while. You want the sun and moonstones. And if that's the case, then you must compete against me. If you win, I'll let you through this. Oh, the stones rest. However, if you lose, you will suffer a terrible fate. By terrible, I mean awful. Mm-hmm. Hoo ha ha. So, what do you want to do? Bah, you utter coward. Be gone. What? What was that? Now you want to try? Bruh. Okay, fine. You're in for it now. Bruh. Hey, hey, it's our time again. Welcome everyone to the 65th Trivia Quiznall. If you correctly answered five of the following questions, you'll win. But get three wrong and you'll suffer. Now, for the first question. What's it in Shrock Portrait? I wish he had a name. Sun and Moonstones, Chris Star, Prince of Peach, Pickle Stone. Is that your real answer? Are you sure? No. Bruh. Arrgh! That's correct! That question was too easy, but only gets harder from here. Much harder! To prepare yourself. What do one mushroom and one flower? But I, don't, I don't remember. I'd say like eight. Well, whatever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> wrong, 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 you fool. Never. If you get three wrong, you're going to suffer like you won't believe. <laughs> don't let the pressure get to you. Moving on. Question three. What is the name of the mayor of Petalmer? Koopa Koot, Bertle, Moopa, Fruit. Moopa. Koopa Koot. Nice PM64 reference there. Or oh, that's correct. That question was too easy, but it only gets harder from here. Much harder. So prepare yourself. Tell me now, where is the Crystal Star? Brokeport, Hookjo, Poe Town, Petalbird. Hooktail Castle. Bro, this is not hard at all, other than the one question, which, you know, I, I wouldn't know, because I wouldn't remember that. Or that's correct! Okay. Diabolical question five. How can one get from Pedal Port Port to Pedal Meadows? Boat across the sea, only by air, go through a pipe, race in a car. Bruh. What am I stupid? Right again. Tell me you didn't just get your first right answer. It can't be true. That's it. I'm making the rest of these near impossible. Get ready for brain pain. On to question six. Little long characters can be found in Petalburg. Koopa Troopas, Goombas, Ball Clips, Buzzies. Gee, I uh, wonder who can be found in Petalburg. Wow. Surely not Koopa Troopas. Wow, no, really? Only one of his questions has slight difficulty. I don't believe it, you won! You win! Bro thinks he's quit Chuck Quizmo so bad right now. I should have brought back Chuck Quizmo. So very angry! I can't believe I lost! I guess I have to let you through, stupid rules. Hmm. Let's try going in the pipe that pop out of the bottom of that weird saturated floor mark. Wow, the music goes hard. Where could the sudden moonstone be? Eh, let's move on for now. Yo, new bag? 
attack multiple foes in order with properly executing attack action commands. I mean, I don't really need Super Feel right now, gotta be honest. Then again, I don't really need close call right now either. Where's Rock Fortress? My, my shoes are totally soaked through, through now. Just great. Wait, she's wearing shoes? I thought all Goombas had... Actually, no, those are shoes, because her feet don't look like normal Goomba feet. Plus, it's dark and confining, and it smells totally bad. This place is not cool, Mario. pretty hard to master, so, uh, practice up. These things really suck. HP. Strong fortress. I saw one a minute ago, and I thought it was a ghost. I totally hate dark places. Okay, actually, mm, yeah. Let's be nice. Oh, Luigi! Hey, man!
just kill them. Didn't feel like dealing with them. So. Thank you, Luigi. Honestly, going for PP right now. All this water has made this place a little cold. I wouldn't mind getting out of here for some fresh air. Soon, you know what I mean? Never jump on anyone, it sucks. Again, multi bounce is fun. to turn on that light in the back. All the moisture makes this place really moldy smelling. What's that other stink? Is that what wet fuzzy smells like? I think we're gonna totally bomb. Okay, we're almost done here. We're in Chalk Fortress. This room is damp and moldy too, like every other one. I just want to see the sun again. Is that so wrong? There's one right there, actually. We don't know where the sunstone is. Oh no, no man. We don't know where it is. Flower. Not bad. I mean, I might want to use it against the fuzzies again, honestly. Yeah. I'll just use Fire Flower. That's kind of OP, but... Just kill them. Kind of OP, but... Okay. 
Okay, well, guess we can leave, leave now. Or can we? We use the stones that we found. We should be able to get to Hotel Castle through a secret pipe. Hey, didn't we see sun and moon shapes near this area where we first saw our trail? Yeah, guess we gotta go back. Oh, I forgot about Gold Fuzzy. Meow, York. Hey, you suspicious types. This is our place. Coming in here is rude, rude, rude. Sorry, suckers. You want a warm welcome? Too bad. Now I launch on your head. That's a gold pussy. Whoa, these are super rare. I'm serious, wow. Max HP is 10, attack is 10, 1, and defense is 0. Oh, but hey, even though it's a pussy, it won't suck up your HP, which is nice. What's the wonder though? How does this thing hide? Look at it, it's so gaudy. Me or oof, hey. You've jumped to tougher than you look. And I'm not through yet. Everyone, get him! Oh, I forgot he does that. Timing to defend, you won't take much damage. Thinking might just be faster than what the ring leaders are, you know? Yeah, thinking about it. Well, I can't really do that now, can I? Ow! Honestly, I want to defeat him. Go, Gumbella. of that. Alright. Me, you're, you got me. Bruh. We use the stones that we found. We should be able to get to Hooktail Castle through a secret pipe. That's kind of funny. Alright, well, let's uh, get... Dude, get going, I guess. Is 
Don't think you got an email, Mario. You should check it out. Press plus to open your email. You can also check your email in your mailbox and change the menu you want. Some folks just like menus, you know? Hey, Mario. Working hard. Professor Franklin here in e-form. It's highly likely you receive emails like this one while you're on your journey, so check your mail often. Actually, oh, nothing more than to say than that, so I hope you all goes well for you. And I look forward to getting more information on those crystal stars. Professor Franklin. I already fought these enemies, man. I don't want to over-level. Gotta hit all the grass now. You never know. Hey, grass, man. Leave me alone. Hey, I mean, I guess I quit for that only. T2ID counter, alright, what is wrong with me? Man, why can't Twitch just auto categorize games if I forget? I get coins.
guy's going crazy. Yeah, the Goombas are easy to avoid at least. I'm a little obsessed with finding coins. I'm sorry. Coins. Okay, good enough. Dear Mario, thanks for registering with Robo Direct Mail, RDM service. Your kind friend, Mr. Frankly, referred to us. Our direct mail service will provide you with regular timely news updates. We hope you enjoy our service. Published by Rogue Poet Restoration Committee. You beat the debatable stone monsters of Schwank? Whoa, well done. But wait, hold on now. That means I have no tub, doesn't it? Well, what do you suppose I should do now? Huh, what a pickle. What? No way. Really? You defeat the monsters in that fortress? Wow, you must be tougher than you look, Mister. I underestimated you. I don't know why. The Coops have been acting odd lately. What could it be bothering him? Probably nothing. He's always freaked about something. I don't mean to sound silly or anything, but what's a hook tail? Boy, the mayor has been so forgetful lately. Oh. He has nothing new to say. Oh, he's gone. That's why I'm always telling my kids not to wander too far from home. Let me cut the fear of hooktail snooping down his village. Okay. New dialogue. That's crew, the mayor of Pedalburg. You just oh wait. Never mind, sorry. Hold on there, Murphy. Found the sun in the moonstone, huh? Have you? Excellent work. Next, you'll need to find the secret pipe that leads to Hooktail Castle. Oh, shake a leg, Murphy. Go! Go show that Hooktail creature who's boss. If only this Hooktail were gone. I'm sure everyone's hearts would shine again. I have just a simple soul, but I remain sure that, that this is the key to restoring happiness here. Hey, what's shaking? I gotta say, I've been playing lots of Nintendo 64 games lately. You know the N64, right? Well, the ga game I play the most on it is Paper Mario. There's this girl in the game. Oh, he's pretty much the cutest boo of all time. Bruh. He's a simp for a bow, apparently. You're going to the castle. You're really dying to get a treasure, aren't you? Careful, Road that Hooktail is not the only... Not... The only nasty beast in that castle. Unless I'm Cheshire too, but do I don't want him to become a snack for it? No thanks. We Cooper's a long lip for a reason, you know. Good luck being a destin and all. Yeah, no, he's just depressed. Nothing new. must be broken. Did you say you're about planning a battle with Hooktail? That sounds like a bad joke. And here's the punchline. You squished the paper thinness. Alright, I guess we're gonna leave here. Ooh. 
Oh wait, oh. Most flowers keep their tongues still, but make no mistake, they understand us. That's why I ask that you always speak kindly to our loyal friends, dear. Uh, something, I don't know. I don't know if you know, but there's an odd-shaped boulder west of the village. I figure it must be a relic of a long-lost civilization. Sounds cool, right? Alright, that's a good place to stop, I think. Probably, maybe... Let's just let some dialogue pass first. Um, excuse me. It's... it's Mario, right? Look, I, um... See, the thing is, I've been waiting here in the hopes of getting to speak with you. Um, see, I was wondering... Would you... Oh, please take me with you to fight Hookale. Please, I'm begging you! Sorry about that. See, my dad, he went off to battle Hooktail long ago, but he never came back. I miss him, of course. I miss him badly. But this isn't just about avenging my dad. Well, no, that's not true. Revenge is a part of it, I guess. A big part. But the truth is, I want to finish what dad started. For his sake, for everyone's sake. I, man, that's embarrassing. See, everyone always says I'm crying every a weekly. But I can beat Hooktail. Well, I won't be those things. I'll be strong, like my dad. Hmm. I know it'll be dangerous, but I still want to go. Please, Mario? Nope, sorry. What? But, but why? Is there any way I can change your mind? No, means no. Well, that's how you feel. I'm not giving up hope, though. I promised myself I wouldn't. Bro, you actually can leave him? Well, not really, but... He's a bit green, but greater than I thought. I'll have to rethink my first impression. I mean, he seems totally earnest. You know what I mean? You should take him along. Nope. Okay, fine. Are you taking me along? Nope. What? Oh. Okay, fine. For real? No kidding! Yes! Thank you so much! You won't regret this! Because I'm joining your party. Your shell can bump into things, which allow allows them to retrieve distant items and act activates wishes. Rex acts to send him flying. Your gold X, you can keep it in place for a while. After keeping him in place, release X to snap him back and hit something beyond his behind the starting point. Following him in place, then hit the switch behind Mario. Mario can also move around while keeping Koops in place, so he can press the switch from a distance. By using L to move while hiding. While holding. So remember, when you send him flying, you can hold X to keep him in one place. Alright, let's... that's pretty much it. By the way, can you shell toss or attack with his body, or strike all the ground by foes with power shell? Laugh your partner in the... Uh, blah 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 blah, okay. Okay, Mario, let's get going. Coops. Oh? Oh, golly. Um, hi. Hi, Koopy 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 Koo. You hear over here all that? Well, part of it. Coops. I thought I heard you say you're off to fight Hooktail, but you're joking, right? I mean, you're not exactly a powerhouse. She'll eat you up. I know, Koopakee, but I want to be tougher for you. No, Coops, you don't. I mean, going out to some dangerous place is stupid. So what if you're timid and sort of a crybaby? I don't care about all that. I just want you to be you, so don't go. Sorry, I made up my mind. I'll be fine. After all, I'm traveling Mario and... Fine, ignore me. Bruh. Stubborn Koopa. I'm sorry, Koopa Koo. I swear to you. I will come back to you with stronger Koopa. Well, Mario, that's that, I guess. No turning back. Hotel's a castle of weeds. Alright. Well, anyway, thank you all so much for watching this stream. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Links on the sidebar. 
Plus, all my Twitch mods there, including a ton of other stuff, such as lots more Mario, Sonic the Hedgehog, Pizza Tower, and a lot more. So if that sounds cool, feel free to check it out. Anyway, have yourselves a fantastic day, and take care.